Aloha gang. Here we are on Kauai at the beautiful Manahuni Fish Pond. This Manahuni Fish Pond has a lot of legend about it. They call it the invisible hands that built the fish pond. They said that they came back one day and the fish pond was built. Legend has it that the Manahuni built this pond. Manahuni are mythical people that lived in Hawaii long before the Hawaiians came here. My belief on the Manahuni is that the Manahuni were regular common people like us, shorter, five feet, seven, five feet, eight. If you were pure Hawaiian of the old Hawaiians that came to Hawaii, they were on an average six foot six, six foot 10, sometimes as tall as seven feet. Some of the tallest Hawaiians were known to be seven foot six. So they were large people. Anything shorter than them were Manahunis. They said the Manahuni built this pond overnight. Manahuni fish pond. There's a supernatural brother and sister that take form in this pond. One becomes a shark and one becomes a mo'o or a lizard. And that's kind of a legend here in this, this fish pond right here. But it's on the beautiful Lihui side of Kauai. Once again, you can see Kauai is also called the Garden Isle. But look how green and lush and beautiful the island of Kauai is. These beautiful mountain peaks that lean back against us. Look right here. This is going towards the south or facing towards the south side west. So southwest side of the island. You can hear the chickens crowing in the background. One thing about Kauai, who got a lot of chickens, wild chickens. Right there, you hear I'm talking? A lot of wild chickens everywhere. A bunch pond. of chickens. In this pond, you'll have, two, uh, they're probably different kinds of fishes, but the fishes that were, they say that the royalty at one time uh, kept this pond and that you could eat out of it. Only the royalty could eat out of it. One of the fish is the mullet. The mullet is a really good white meat fish and we would steam it and we'd eat it. Another one of the fish out here is ava, and we call it a milk fish, but the ava itself is out here. Along the edges of the Manahuni fish pond, you got these mangroves. These mangroves grow, and they actually have a lot of nutrition because it's both. What makes these ponds kind of uh, significant is you have the fresh water coming down and the salt water come, and when they mix each other, they become brackish water. In brackish water, there's a lot of nutrients and the nutrients stay up under the mangrove here and these crabs known as Samoan crabs live under them and that's where they eat. So if you put a net down in here or catch them, you'd be amazed at how big the crabs are when you pull them out of there. Believe me, you don't want to get your finger caught in their claws. If they catch your finger, say bye-bye. You're going to be like this. Your shaka is going to be like only like, like this, a thumb. You'll have no pinky for the shaka. That's just it, man. You can't even do shaka. It'd be like lame. Hey, shaka, bro. You'd have to shock her with this finger, I think. That's how your shocker would be. Aloha. <laughs>